Hi, I'm Kevin Russell. I'm a volleyball coach here in South Beach, Florida. Let's talk a little bit about the history in volleyball. Um, William Morgan did invent volleyball in 1895. Uh, it was an indoor sport. It went to college uh, a few years after that. The first official game in college was played in 1901. And in 1928, the USVBA was uh, created, which is the United States Volleyball Association, uh, which is now called the USAV. Uh, they just basically dropped the B out of it, uh, which is now USA Volleyball. Um, in 1947, the FIVB was uh, created, which is the uh, Federal International uh, Volleyball Association. Uh, they generally make all the rules for us now. Um, we kind of follow them. The USA used to be the forefront in making all the rules, but we kind of switched over to the international uh, for the fact that they run uh, the, the Olympics, Pan America Games, uh, all those kind of things. Um, in 1983, um, just like behind me, beach volleyball was created as a professional sport. Uh, it went to two-man teams. It was owned by the players, and uh, they just they liked to have something, and it draws a lot of crowd. Uh, the indoor sport was losing uh, a lot of interest in crowd, so they kind of evolved and made things uh, happen. Uh, indoor is now becoming uh, more popular again uh, within schools. There's men's, there's women's teams. Um, basically every college has a volleyball team. If you go to high school, junior high, uh, you just can't escape the volleyball world. It has uh, really, really made its way um, from 1895 being as many players as you wanted to now being very, very organized and lots of rules to uh, keep you really on your toes. Uh, that's just a little bit about the history of volleyball.